Hello everyone, it's me, Megamia here, back for another video. Now, if you follow my Discord, you know I was not gonna upload for a while. But, this was so necessary to upload, that I just had to, to, to upload. I just had to upload this. There was no other thing, there was no other thing I could have done. Because when I saw these things on Amazon, below retail, by the way, I knew I had to pick it up. It was the uh, Marvel Studios Disney Plus CMF series that has been long awaited by fans. And some of the figures, when they first laid, I actually didn't see for real. But we're going to get into all of that here in a minute. First, I'm going to tell you a little bit of an interesting thing about this particular package. The reviews were pretty mixed, even though it was being sold by Lego. It was being sold by Lego. The reviews were pretty mixed, right? There were some people... You know, most of the people who reviewed the product got the exact same figures. Exact same six different figures in this. So, you know, I'm going to get six different figures or I'm going to get all of the same figures. It really does depend. So, I guess we'll open... Because I already opened this to make sure all the packs were there because this almost didn't arrive. So, I had to make sure that everything was good with the packets. And, yeah, so I probably could have done a better job unpackaging this but i was pretty excited don't at me right this is the new box of six for these now that's not really like really sewn too much like this is pretty new as far as i'm aware i don't think this really has existed before so i'm just gonna pull out the six of them the uh, six of them one two three Four, five, six. Just had to make sure again. And I guess we'll go over the packaging on these because it's just glorious. Like, seriously, some of these figures are amazing. Now, what figures from the series do I really want? Uh, worst case scenario, these are going to be... There's going to be, like, either Buffy or Monica Rambo, which are... Which are Kinda, or Sylvie, because they're not really the greatest figures. I mean, they're good for normal figure standards, but obviously this series is not normal figure standards. Uh, but really, none of these figures were bad. There is not a single figure I am disappointed with. The only thing I'm kind of disappointed with are the, uh, these two WandaVision, the Wanda and Vision from WandaVision. It's just like, yeah, they're pretty... The Vision's really inaccurate, and what is going on with that? That's really just the only thing that I do not like. Maybe Croc Crocodile Loki not having the, uh, his headdress. Kind of kind of whack, but see, I have these. Now, these are really hard to find, considering people are buying way too much of these. So, I would really recommend um, hovering over either Amazon or continuing to go to any store that you think might have these. Because as soon as they restock, they're probably going to be out of stock, especially on any online stores you're buying from. So, mainly I will watch out for that. So, without all of the three minutes of rambling we've done, I got my scissors. We're going to do like what, 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 what we're going to do what we did during the days when I used to open up Halo Mega Constructs bags. We're going to open up one by one while talking about the series. And I guess we'll start with this one being the first. I'm, I haven't felt these. I've only took one out of the box to make sure to count them all. And this is the first one I'm opening. I didn't cut enough, did I? Uh, rip. I'm also keeping one of these bags for, like, later meddling and, like, just saying, hey, I have these. So, first figure. Let's see what it is. Let's pour it out. And it's Loki. Okay. Uh, we got TVA Loki from Loki, which is my favorite Disney Plus Marvel show. Closely rifled by What If, because What If is What If is really good. But we got Loki here. We're gonna build him alive because why not? And yeah, this is just such a good figure. We got Srog. A Lego Shrog. I never thought that this was going to exist, but it does. And it is absolutely amazing. Now, they do come with these Axe and Pose stands, which, I, which was pretty unexpected. But yeah, TVA Loki, it is just some 
amazing. I love this hairpiece as well. The variant back. This figure isn't really too detailed. Like, you can see the, uh, front torso printing. No arm, side leg printing, which is what most of these figures in this series have. So, you know, TVA Loki, that's a good start. Let's just hope we don't get duplicates, because unlike Mega Construct blind bags, you do not want to get l duplicates of Lego blind bags. They're just, it's just a pain. Okay, bag two. I see green. Oh, it's Sylvie. Sylvie's in an extra bag. Why? <laughs> like, I, I could rant about that for a while. But why, Lego, are you putting these figures in extra bags? I don't understand that. We got Sylvie. So we got the both of the Loki characters in this series. So that, in this opening. So that's really nice. Now, Sylvie, I think Sylvie's kind of a disappointment, honestly. Uh, actually, ooh, that's some nice printing there. That's some nice arm printing. But yeah, now now I have Lego Sylvie and Crocodile Loki. So that's, that is just amazing. I mean, th this Crocodile piece is just so good to move him over so we have Crocodile Loki. It's just such a good piece, man. I don't like that he doesn't have the headdress, though. He should have had the headdress. I know some people are like, oh, but it's useful. This crocodile mode's gonna be used to death here in a few months. I guarantee it that the next LEGO City set that releases, that's gonna get revealed, is gonna come with a crocodile. I guarantee it. Um, I'm gonna get added when it doesn't, and like, oh, you're wrong. Uh, I forgot to sew the set list. We should probably do that. Oh, these are the ones they taped off. Oh, forget about it. <laughs> they taped it. Forget about it. Forget the sack list. But yeah, we got both of the Loki characters. So that's really nice. Both of those are really nice. And also, forgot to mention Sylvie's hairpiece. My god, is that great. That is just immaculate. Love it. I. We still don't have Falcon or Spider-Man. Or Tatala or like, Black Panther or Star Wars. I'm not going to try to pronounce his name because I'm going to offend someone. And we got... Oh. Okay. Okay. Winter Soldier. Now, I did not like Falcon in the Winter Soldier. I'm going to be honest. I didn't really enjoy the sew. It wasn't the greatest. But, you know, this isn't bad. Uh, like, this figure is kind of not the greatest. Also, there's two jumper pieces in this. These, like, action pose stands in this bag. Kind of interesting. Oh, that arm printing, though. That is beautiful. And that sealed. That is just the best. That is the best thing. That is just great. Uh, the other figure, the, the other, the other, uh, Winter Soldier Fair. I wonder if this is, if we're gonna get Falcon. Because, so far we've gotten, uh, Loki, Sylvie. We're gonna get, f uh, Bucky and Falcon, and then we're gonna get another set. It seems like what's gonna happen here, but... Honestly, this might be my favorite. A lot of people say this figure's not great. And yeah, it's not the best, but... Compared to normal figures, it is just... Outstanding. Right, we got three bags left, self to six. I'll try to get more of these if I can, but again, it is really hard to find these. They keep going out of stock rapidly. They think it might be going out of stock more than the 503 battle pack, but don't quote me on that. Right, next bag. Yes! Thank the Lord that I got the most underused figure. The most underused character in all of the MCU. All of what if. Zombie Captain America. This figure. Is the absolute best. One of my. Just, like. Dude. I forgot about this figure. I really did. Because. I've heard this figure's really come. This is the first time I've got this. Because I haven't. I haven't gotten any of the end game. Upsets. Really. For Marvel. But Zombie Captain America. My god, also that sealed. That's so good. Dude, I absolutely and utterly love this. As we were doing an accent stand, forget about it. We're doing an accent stand 
for zombie Captain America here. He deserves it. He honestly deserves it. I, can he stand with it? Okay, he can. But yeah, zombie Captain America, that is just... Wow, that is a, that is a find right there. I, I am very happy. Also, look at that side leg printing. Oh, I, seriously, you never see that on figures. But the fact that this series has so many figures with side leg printing is just... I didn't cut... Wait, I know, I did. Right. And, oh. Oh, I keep forgetting about these good figures. I keep forgetting about all the good figures in this series. Oh, my God. <laughs> Santos Gamora. So, I don't know what was going on because none of these figures... Or the figures that people were getting. Actually, I think people were getting Winter Soldier. But, like, what were those reviews? I don't know. I'm not gonna go look too much into it. Oh, that side leg for... That side... Oh, that's so good. That's so good. That is so good. Golden lightsaber. So, uh, I'm, I'm so happy they included two of these. Because I'm like, using one for Palpatine. Don't even... Don't even question. It is happening. What I'm wondering if this figure is ever gonna be used in actually what if I saw it was gonna be in the this in the Tasala the um I'm I'm missing I know I am the Black Panther Star Lord episode but it wasn't so that's interesting also that stand is getting on my nerve right last pack we've been doing this for ten minutes now let's see it. this is either gonna be a repeat or a new figure. And I would honestly be happy with any of the figures because, except really Monica, because that figure's not really great. Uh, I think that's Wanda, considering by that cape. I saw it was Spider-Man for a second, but looking at that 4 plus cape, no, it's Wanda. Yeah, Wanda. That's, that's, that's still a good one. I, I, I'm, I, I'm pretty happy with that. Like, having these all be different figures and all, I, I'm pretty happy with that, you know. Pretty happy with that. Let's build. Oh, I did. oh that's that's amazing. That front, that is amazing. First ever one of these four plus capes. I gotta, I actually gotta get a head on it because this, this is weird. Yeah, I don't know how I feel about that. This, interesting. And... It's not bad. It really isn't that bad. Like, it's not horrible. Could be worse. Could be worse. Then we got these red power blasts. Oh, that's great. Right, there we go. There is all six of our Marvel CMF figures. Recap. Oh my god, there's so many stands and extra pieces. They're everywhere. So, this is what I got from 6. I got TVA, Loki, Sylvie, uh, Winter Soldier, Bucky, whatever. Whatever. We got Zombie Captain America, just an absolute amazing figure. S Sanos Gamora, and Wanda. So, that's, like, just absolutely amazing. These, these, this series is amazing. I can't really say I'm surprised considering all of the extensive amount of videos I've watched on this series. It is just amazing. I love every single figure. But yeah, thank you all so much for watching this video. I I hope you all enjoyed. I definitely enjoyed opening these. And if you did enjoy this video, go right ahead and like and subscribe to this channel. Every subscriber and every, every person who likes, thank you, is appreciated tenfold. Okay, everyone, I will see you all in the next video. Bye-bye.